Did you know that Rossi has free sample boxes? Of course you did. You've probably seen them at the AHR Expo, maybe a Smackna show here and there, but you're probably wondering well, what is in that box. Today we're going to find out together. You got a welcome message. Welcome to the ultimate duct hardware. We're going to see why it is that. Move the wrapping, get some of the styrofoam out of the way. The mega lock positive locking regulator is right on top. You can hear the clicking, which that's what tells you it's locked into place. Set it, forget it. There's a fully assembled sleeve inside. Another bundle here with a bunch of stuff we're going to look at. The fully assembled sleeve is mostly for demo. It shows you the entire thing assembled when you get all the Rossi components and put them in. We're going to do a different video uh, to show the 90 second assembly process. Here you've got the Everlock regulator um, uh, patented. You can hear it kind of click into place. Be careful of the knockoffs. We've all seen a few that are starting to kind of look like the Everlock. How do you know the difference? Well, the competitors don't have the patented locking system. So they look like this with the ridges, but then they add an additional screw that you have to tighten at the end of all that. Isn't the whole point to get rid of the wing nut, to get rid of the screws which rattle loose and get the positive locking? So be really careful about that. In the bundle, you've got two samples of the Everlock positive locking regulator. You got the two inch standoff, the one and a half inch standoff. For finer measurements, I would say uh, even finer than plus or minus 5% at three water gauge on say an eight inch diameter blade. You got the twist lock regulator. We've got this in two sizes as well, the two inch, the one and a half. Um, the polymer is a far superior friction lock against the metal than a standard wing nut would be. People love that. And then there's the flat twist lock for those hard to reach places. Sits right against the duct wall. Snap in bushings, our most popular bushings, in 3 8 half inch, as well as a long version for line duct airtight. Um, U channels to attach the bar to maybe your blade. You might be using a rectangular blade or a larger than 16 inch diameter. The U-channels are great. Um, other kinds of bushings like the B300s and the B330s, which are open end and close end with an E-clip for higher pressure or negative pressure jobs. All kinds of cool stuff. And then in the box, there are some samples of 3 8 inch bars, as well as some blades. You got like a six inch blade, an eight inch blade. They make great uh, throwing stars. If there's anybody around the office, don't do that. And finally, there's some literature. We've got an awesome brochure, a uh, submittal with product data sheets on every component, an order form, and a 10-part CSI format engineering spec. That takes care of all the technical data so you can get Rossi specified on your project. You know how to get the box. Click on the link, get one for yourself, and find out why duck chops across the country are making the switch to the ultimate damper hardware.